y'all hey y'all hey y'all welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be about boric acid suppositories and if that's what you are interested in keep on watching sis keep on watching I tried boric acid suppositories okay now y'all might be like yo you're holistic why are you trying boric acid suppositories yeah I know okay so I tried it I could try stuff okay dang so when I first heard boric acid suppositories I was like because a company hit me up and they told me like yo you want to try our boric acid suppositories and I was like eh, no are you crazy um but I found out that you can put them in your vaginal canal at a low dose but do not consume them this way you can't take them but this way you can and i don't like that really but let me tell y'all why i tried it right okay so i got off my period right and then i don't know what was going on with this particular period i don't know what was happening but it was like not the same it didn't smell the same it didn't feel the same and then i don't like honestly I, to this day i still don't even know what happened with that period like it just felt weird and it just made me feel weird too and it also lasted longer which is weird but anyway um so i got out the shower right and i took my little ph strip because y'all know i test my ph frequently and it was high like it was stupid high like i was almost at a five and for y'all who know you should be at like a three or like a four like a kind of like a high four point something abnormal is around five and bitch i was almost at a five okay and i was like what the heck and i i didn't feel the same i felt like mustier that period was like thicker and gookier it was just gross bruh and it didn't even start off the same but anyway anyway anyway, anyway. so i tested it and then it was just off and my ph balance was off i was like cool maybe it'll go down a little bit you know what i mean maybe like throughout time because this was like the second day i was off my period i was like maybe throughout time my period will and it didn't sis it just stayed at that damn five damn near like my ph strip was blue as f and it's supposed to be green not blue okay so it just so happened that i was just scrolling on youtube i saw this other girl um i don't i don't know her name on youtube and i was like let me look and see what this is supposed to do because i was having issues boric acid is supposed to cure reoccurring bv and yeast infections also keep your ph balance level okay like you can pop one of these in for like two three days don't go past seven days but up to seven days and it should cure whatever's going on up in there so i was listening to this girl yap about some boric acid right and she was actually talking about the neutroblast neutroblast is actually the company that contacted me um on it and i told them no because i was just too like wet for them um low-key is probably shade to them but anyway yeah so she was talking about the neutral blast one i was listening to her and i was like let me just go online and try these boric acid ones because my ph balance is high right now this is a good time to do this instead of using my apple cider vinegar like doing it the holistic way and just taking that time you know what i mean like this is like an all-time high of my knowledge i should say because i just started testing my ph but of my knowledge this is like the all-time high i have ever been which is kind of freaking me out so let me try this so girl i went and bought these you see these you probably can't see these it's called fresh but it's for the ph boric acid vaginal suppositories right okay sis let me tell you my experience now i popped one okay i was scared a bitch was scared okay i put it up in there i thought i was gonna start burning i was like oh yeah i'm about to die my pussy about to fall off like <laughs> like i just thought it was gonna be all bad but i didn't feel nothing but i did read in the com or not in the comments in the um reviews to lay down a panty liner y'all know i'm good for a panty liner so i put that on i laid that on so I, I put it on in the morning though you should do it at night a lot of reviews said that you should do it at night do it at night don't do it in the morning um but i did it in the morning because i don't follow rules so i slapped it on and girl i was at work girl when i tell you i went to the bathroom and my coochie was juicy 
okay you hear me juicy okay like all the all of the the stuff up in these little capsules was coming out and it, it's kind of grainy it just feels a little bit grainy so it's coming out right so okay you hear me and i was like don't go chasing waterfalls because my coochie is wet it in a I was playing. Um, but that's how it felt. Like, it was just so moist down there, okay? So, I'm, here I am changing pads or whatever. So, I popped so I popped them in for, so I put in, I think I used four. I'm going to say I used four. I did it four days in a row, right? So, I did it for four days. Girl, on that fourth day, your coochie, like I tested it, okay? My coochie was back down to its regular pH, so it did its pH level job. And I didn't even have a hint of a scent. Like my natural scent, nada. My, my, y'all know I told y'all I'd be musty after work? Finito, nothing. I didn't smell anything. It smelled like I just took a shower. Like girl, when I tell you this thing wiped out every single last scent that could have even I didn't have a natural scent. Y'all know I'll be telling y'all about y'all natural scents. I didn't even have a natural scent. If there was nothing, no scent, nada. And it stayed like that. Like, and then I hit my next period and my next period was just, oh, my next period was normal. And then I popped in one after that just to, come on next stride you feel me like oh my goodness this stuff boric acid is the truth it doesn't burn it doesn't hurt if you're not used to um like if you've ever put in like those tampons without an applicator you'll be fine if you haven't you might have a hard time or like uh the yoni pearls if you never put in yoni pearls like that you might have a hard time but this was hella easy for me and the higher you put it in the better okay yeah pretty much i was I was a river and I was a clean river like this thing I will I will use one after every period let me tell you all that even though this is not a holistic product fresh 600 mg's vaginal suppositories promotes he healthy pH balance supports vaginal health yeah I don't know why I said that like that. But yeah, this this is the truth. Boric acid suppositories are the truth. So if you are thinking about doing um, boric acid suppositories, I recommend them to the fullest. And I am a holistic person. I am not a chemical aiding kind of girl. And I was definitely scared too before I put them in. Do not be scared. It don't burn. It don't hurt. You just ain't gonna smell like nothing. Like you literally don't even have, like musty is not even a thing. I felt like I literally could go have a three hour workout and, and then my Gucci wouldn't even stink. Cause like, cause of these. And I'm not kidding. I wish I was exaggerating. I'm not exaggerating. There's no scent, okay? I will definitely link these ones if I can in the description box below. Um, and yeah. That's all I gotta say about these. If you have any questions or comments, um, go ahead and put those down below. Y'all who recommended these, cause there's a bunch of comments um, in other videos talking about try these and I kept on telling y'all, hell no, I'm sorry. Um, y'all know what y'all talking about. All right, that's all I have to say. Bye guys.